Gonna tell my mom that I go by Winnie the Pooh because I'm always elbow deep in that honey pot. How am I gonna tell my mom that I go by Shia LaBeouf because I spend all day in holes? Wow, in a row, two lesbians, wow. <laughs> Fucking great. I do feel like I need to come out as straight. <laughs> I am straight, thank you so much, thank you. Thank you. My mom thinks I'm gay and I get it. <laughs> Especially with this haircut. Cause this haircut screams business in the front, come on my back. My mom, she really wants me to be gay. She like really wants me to be gay. And I don't know how to break it to her that I like women. Thank you. <laughs> like how do you tell the woman that raised you, someone that's loved you unconditionally your entire life, how do you tell her that you can make that shit sound like mac and cheese? <laughs> like how am I gonna tell my mom that I get so much cave, might as well be a damn bear. How am I, you all better get on fucking board with these. How am I gonna tell my mom that I go by Winnie the Pooh because I'm always elbow deep in that honey pot? How am I gonna tell my mom that I go by Shia LaBeouf because I spend all day in holes? How am I gonna, I got five hours, it's fucking shit. How am I gonna tell my mom that I go by Lou Gehrig because I'm always hitting home runs and spazzing on the bitch? Anyone here with Lou Gehrig's disease? There's usually one crawling around somewhere. How am I gonna tell my mom that I don't like coffee, but I love the bean? Thank you. Speaking of coffee, every single coffee shop ever is run by they thems. They thems be making the best coffee, dude. They really know what they them be doing in there. Them is killing a dog. I once got a cappuccino from a he him. It gave me diarrhea. I don't trust it. I used to be one of them theys. I was uh, one of them theys. I did my non-binary gap year and I want you to be comfortable and back to being a he him, all right? I'm a he him, but I was one of them days and people didn't know why I did it. Listen, I'll tell you why I did it. I did it so I could get some they hole. Now, <laughs> listen, if you've never had thussy, I would <laughs> recommend it. It is top tier hole. People didn't know what it meant. I had to explain it to them. So what is being non-binary? What's that even mean that I was one of them days? <laughs> so gender's a spectrum, right? So you got man, woman, everything in between. So whenever I was non-binary, there are some days when I'd wake up and I'd feel like I was a woman. And then other days I was funny. Listen, I hate when that joke bombs because it means I'm a fucking woman and I... <laughs> I do think we need to go back to the good old days though. We need to go back to the good old days. These days people don't, they can't even agree on what is a man. People can't agree on what is a woman. What is a man? What is a woman? It's simple really. If you are hot, then you are a woman. <laughs> if you are not hot, you're a man. <laughs> 
if you're an ugly man dating an ugly woman, you are gay. <laughs> Hot and ugly, those are the two genders. <laughs> and if you don't know which one you are, we know which one you are. <laughs> Hot and ugly. But what about a kid? Can a kid be ugly? Yeah? Can a kid be hot? <laughs> Come on, let's talk about it. Can a kid be hot? What do you think, sir? Can a kid be hot? Can it? Dude, the answer is no. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> Jesus Christ. The answer is no. No, a kid cannot be hot, all right? No, a kid cannot be hot. Bad. Bad. A kid is not hot. A kid can be cute. So a cute baby is cute. An ugly baby is a man. <laughs> Thank you all so much.